I'm talking about. Okay, I'm here with my main man, Highlight. Say hello, Highlight. So. What? Mm -hmm. <laughs> anyway, we're going to do some addition. We're going to add, but we're also going to do some multiplication. Do you know how to multiply? Um, sort, of. I, sort of. I bet you you can multiply. You, I bet you didn't even know it. Multiplication. All multiplication is just doing a lot of adding. But let's do some adding first. Let's look at these triangles. Yeah. How can I find out how many triangles I have, Highlight? Counting. By counting them. Okay. But I Oops. know. Um, um, made a mistake in putting another triangle there. You, but but what now? I know how many there is. How many are there? Six. There's six. What did you do? You counted them? No. Well, yes, you did. You probably went one, two, three, four, five, six. You're right. There's no. six triangles. No, I went like two, 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 and I know that makes six. Whoa. That's what I'm going to get to today when you're talking about two, two, and two makes six because you said two, three times. And, well, let's talk about what, it, what we're talking about. What we're, we're three plus three. Well, it's two here, right? Yeah. And there's two here, right? Yeah. And how many are here? Two. Two. Okay, well, let's, let's see here. If we say, add these up, two plus two plus two, it equals, what does it equal? Six. Six. So that's just adding. You know how to add. We because you know you you know how to add. You put up two fingers and you put up another two fingers and you put another two fingers. You count them all together, right? That's called adding. That's addition. But we're gonna go over something else today. We're gonna go over something called multiplication. That's a pretty long word. Multiplication. Multiplication. All right. Multiplication. So highly, really, what you told me was you knew that this was six because you said two. Two and two. How many times did you say two? Three One. times. You said three times. So you know what you just did? You did multiplication. You had a multiplier. Because you said two times. That's the time symbol. Three is equal to six. Six. You multiply. Hold on. What grade are you in? First. Oh, no. No. You're not in first grade multiplying. No, you are not. I can't believe that you're in first yes, grade multiplying. No because way. Because three plus three is six. And I counted the twos three times. Whoa. So that's basically it. You know, because you're right. Because we could say two plus two plus two is equal to six. And let, let's, you made a good point here, Highly. Check this out. If we say, let's put up some more triangle. We say, oops. The triangles work. Let's put us more triangles. Triangle. Bam. Okay. Okay, oh, we gotta do like this. This one, two, and three triangles there. And then we put one, two, two, and three triangles here. They're not, they're kind of not, not spaced all around, but you got the point, right? So here. Let's see what we're dealing with here. Because how many triangles are there in this case, Holly? How many triangles are there? Six. Six, right? But in this time, we don't have two, two, and two. This time, we have... Three and three. Three and three. And we could just easily just say three plus three is equal to six. Oh, what are you trying to, what are you trying to do? You're trying to take over the writing now? you you just big time. Three plus three equals six. Or we can say three. How many times? How many threes do we have? How many sets of threes do we have? We said three and three. How many times did we say three? Three two and th two times. So that means three times two is equal to six. Six. Can you notice something here? Two times three is six. Three times two is six. You can reverse them and get the same answer. Wow. Oh, yes. Three times two is six and two times three is six. And I think we're out of here.